going ice fishing. For this experiment, you will need some salt, about 12 inches of string or yarn, a glass, some ice, and some water. The first thing that you want to do is take some ice and pour it into your glass. Next, you want to add some water. All right, you ready to go fishing? Let's try. You want to take the string and place it onto the ice. Wait, why am I not touching anything? We forgot the most important part, the salt. Now what you want to do is take your yarn and place it onto the ice, and then take your salt and pour it onto the ice. Now, you want to wait for about 30 seconds. Okay. Gently pull the string up out of the water and let's see if we caught anything. We caught a giant fish! How does this work? First, let's review some words. Temperature, a measure of how fast the atoms or molecules of a substance are moving. As the temperature increases, goes up, the molecules or atoms move faster. As the temperature decreases, goes down, the molecules or atoms move slower. Freezing point, the temperature where a liquid becomes a solid. Why did the ice attach to the string? Well, water freezes at 32 degrees Fahrenheit. When salt is added to water, it lowers the water's freezing point or temperature. This means that the temperature of water has to get colder than 32 degrees Fahrenheit to freeze. When the salt was added to the ice cube, it lowered the ice cube's freezing point. The ice cube cannot get any colder, so it starts to melt. As the ice cube starts to melt, a layer of water forms on top of the ice cube and the string sinks into it. As the ice cube continues to melt, it continues to dilute the salt and water mixture which causes the freezing point to go back up. Because the ice is surrounded by freezing temperature, the ice refreezes, causing a layer of ice to form over the string. Once a layer of ice is formed, the string can be picked up and along comes the ice attached to it. Did you know this is the same concept used in making homemade ice cream and preventing ice from building up on streets? When making homemade ice cream, Salt is added to the ice, which lowers the freezing point so that the ice cream mixture can freeze into ice cream-like consistency. After a snowfall, and when the outdoor temperature is below water's freezing point, 32 degrees Fahrenheit, then trucks spread salt on the streets to lower the freezing point to prevent ice from building up on them. Take it to the next level. Instead of using salt to lower water's freezing point, Try sugar and pepper to see if these substances also lower water's freezing point. Thanks for watching!